You ever just tried to... I'm trying to get all the good stuff out first. It's your girl, Jaylee. So, I am back. It is really early, y'all. It is Sunday morning. And it's early. But I'm back to y'all with another video. With another video. Um, I'm up. Got my coffee, y'all. Got my water. And we about to be creating some stuff. I am going to test out another foundation, y'all. Right now, I am just really trying stuff because I have so much stuff in here that I was just like, I need to catch up. So, the one I'm going to try today is the Bare Minerals Matte uh, Powder Foundation. I have never, y'all, done a powder foundation on my skin. So, y'all, I don't know how this is going to go. I am actually, for the first time, going to look at some reviews on how to use a foundation. Because I've never used a powder foundation. But somebody said it's really good for matte skin. I meant for oily skin. To keep it matte. So, we're going to try it. Oh! I don't know. I'm scared right now. But, again, y'all know I get stuff on sale. I got it on sale from all stuff when it was like twenty nineteen dollars I think, or something like that. And I got two of them just in case I liked it. Um, but this is what we are about to try out. And if you have sat through this like a minute and something and you haven't subscribed and if you watch more than one video, if this is your first one, welcome. If you watch more than one, <laughs> thank you for coming back. Subscribe while you're here. Boom, boom, boom. Share it with a friend. And y'all keep on watching so we can see. If I mess this up, if I get it right. If it's going back to Alta, let's go. <gasps> okay, y'all, so I'm back. I looked at some other videos to see exactly how to do this foundation. I went online, got a little bit of deets about it because I just sort of bought it. Um, I'm, mm, I'm not sure. I'm trying to go in with an open mat. Um, I know they do have 30 shades in this foundation. It retails for about, I think, $31 or something like that. Um, supposed to have SPF 15. Supposed to be really natural. Now, with that being said, with the 30 shades, I'm a little on not excited as some other people were. Because I'm next to the last shade. Um, I got it in Neutral Deep 29. And then you have 30. And I am not your darkest person in the world. Um, I did open it. I was trying to figure it out while I was watching the video. Because I didn't know what I was telling y'all. But I do think it looks it pretty convenient. They say, like I had to rip this little thing out right here. Um, they said you're supposed to put a little bit of this in this top. Swirl it around and pat it on. It's supposed to be sheer to full coverage. I've never seen a foundation say sheer all the way to full. Because that's a lot in the middle. But. um, And it came with some like little instructions. That I can't see. At all. Like I really can't see it. For real. But I guess, you know, say put it on there. You're supposed to buff it in your skin in circular motion. So I'm about to do that right now. Um, I'm not even going to put my eyebrows on first. I'm going to literally do this. So, y'all watch while I do. It was, uh, it's cosmetics brush. Um, buffing brush. So we're going to try it. Because that's what everybody else did. So I shook a, shook a little bit in this top. And we about to try to buff this on my face. It says sheer to full, so I didn't use any corrector. Because mm -hmm, we're going to see. Let's go. Oh, listen to me. I don't see nothing. Oh, 
Okay, I'm gonna try another brush. I'm gonna try this smaller, denser brush. Maybe that'll work. I'm gonna brush a little bit of it in here and. Okay, that helped a little bit better. So we're gonna try that. Okay, so I went through this whole like rant about I wasn't going to keep trying this. But I'm going to be a good sport. And I'm going to keep going. I'm going to keep going for y'all, y'all. Like, I'm going to keep going. Because right now, I'm not feeling the color that it changed me. But we're going to see what we could do with some additional products and stuff so let me finish the rest of my face and i will be right back okay i'm back y'all i have finished the rest of my face so we know earlier i was having some issues we was coming through and i said i was gonna fight for this for y'all so i did finish the look um Let's start off with saying, again, I'm using the Bare Minerals Matte Neutral Deep 29. That's my sh that's the shade I purchased. Um, I will say I like the finish. It was nice. After I put on all the products, it actually did cover all my hyperpigmentation. Because I'm doing these, y'all, without concealing. And, you know, color correcting or anything like that. Um, it does feel like I don't have anything on my skin at all. Like, I'm not even going to lie. My face feels so fresh. It's ridiculous. Um, it worked well with other cream products because I used the NARS um, Soft Matte Complete Concealer on my face. Um, and it didn't bunch up or anything like that with me putting... Um, liquid and you know non-powder products on it which was good because I wasn't sure how that was going to work because I've never used a powder foundation before um I'm on the fence with this shade um just a little I'm not necessarily sure if I like the shade um that I picked up um, you guys comment down below. Tell me what you think. Um, and this is, it looks better after I put additional products on it. Um, because before, just with the foundation, I looked very, very, very gray. Um, and dark and it was patchy. Um, but once I did put on other products, I do like it. Um, I am going to go ahead and wear this for the rest of the day before I really, really make a whole decision on it. Um, but you guys tell me right now what you think so far before you see where we come out with this wear test. Um, my own, my few qualms with it, like I said, was the fact that I did look gray. Um, and it looked really, really dark. Like when I began to put it on, I felt like it just started turning gray in a dark, a dirty, dark brown. Um, also the shade range isn't wide. Yes, it is 30 shades. But I'm 29. So if I'm number 29, I am far from being the darkest woman of color that is out here. Um, 
And there were only about four shades that I could really pick from to begin with um, in the line. So it, even though they're 30, they're really not women of deeper skin tone um, friendly. But I am going to wear this for the rest of the day. And I will see you guys in a few. And just... And just so you know, it's about 11.14 right now. And I got some stuff I'm about to do. We're going to sew, going to church, doing some other stuff. And I got to do some hair. So, got a full day. Um, and I will keep you guys, you guys, I will keep you guys updated. And I'm going to go ahead and take some pictures as well. And insert those so y'all can see what it looks like. Um, what the pictures look like and stuff like that. So, I will be back in a few hours. Mwah. Okay, y'all, so I'm back. It is about 2.30. Um, I'm, um, I'm not sure um, if it's just me, but this foundation, it says it's matte, but it's not keeping me matte at all. It's only been on for like, what, three hours, maybe four, something like that. All I've been doing is editing. Um, doing some dishes, um, watch some TV, stuff like that. I haven't done enough for it to be this oily. Um, like in it transfers. Um, I doubt I'm gonna be able to keep this on all day. Um, I did take my wig off, y'all, because I decided not to leave the house. But I'm. I just wanted to come back in because I don't know how much longer. I'm actually going to be able to keep this on. Um, and it brought so much texture to my skin. It's ridiculous. Um, and it turned this funky, wonky color as well. Bare Minerals, I was really rooting and fighting for you. I even kept going. But I don't see this going anywhere good right now. Um, I'm going to keep it on for a little bit longer. Try to make it through dinner. Try to blot out, mm, blot out. Try to blot, you know, just see where we go from there. But right now, with this 2.30 check-in, it's we still not in a good place. We still not in a good place. Um, but if you look like y'all, look, you can see all the texture in my skin. Like, my pores are everywhere, like right in my nose area. Around my mouth, it's breaking up. And I ain't, haven't eaten or anything, so... I don't know what's going on, but I'll see y'all in a little bit. Okay, y'all, I'm back. Um, I'm going to try to block this out and see what we get. Um, just like to see where it goes because um, my face feels a little funny. And... I'm not sure why, but it just feels a little itchy, sort of like, I think. Um, but I'm a, I don't know. I, it's funny because it looks decent and it matter. Oh my God, I'm so upset right now because I feel indifferent about this foundation. In certain lights, I actually like it. And in other ones, I can't stand it. I don't know what to do, y'all. But I will say that it didn't um, come off or anything like that when I did just um, try to blot it out. And it's funny because I feel like once I just really reset it, it um the places that it was breaking up, it didn't anymore. Um, like it sort of just mushed it back together, I guess, if I could say that. But I don't know. Um 
It's around four, I think, three, four. So I will see y'all again in a little while. And probably by the next time I see y'all, I'm going to be ready to actually uh, take it off. Um, I just happened to be back in my studio. So I was like, let me sit down, record, and do it under the lights. Because I just had to do some hair, and I just finished doing it. So, yeah. See y'all in a few. Okay. Sure. I am back for the final check-in. It's around 7.30. Um... Let's go with this first. I will say that the shade did get better as the day went on. I'll say that. Um, the coverage was decent. I'll say that. Um, was it mattifying for me? No. Like, it's really sticky. And it's coming off on my fingers. Um, and I've actually blotted probably, like, right before I came on here. Um, so, no. Um, it does show my pores a lot. Um, so for me, I didn't like that. Um, I don't see me gravitating towards it and just it being something that I just say, Ooh, this is a must have for me. No. Would I have paid $31 for it? No. Um, would I possibly keep it because keep, cause I got two, so I'm taking one back. Would I possibly keep it because it was $19? There's a possibility. Mm-mm. It wasn't for me. Um, it wasn't mattifying for me. Um, it transferred, got on my cell phone, got on my clothes. You know, just it 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 wasn't for me. Um, comment down below, let me know what you think if you tried it. Um Um Going to end it there. Because this one was... Uh, no. I'm going to leave some more videos over here for y'all to watch. Subscribe right here. And I want to thank y'all for watching. Like it. Comment. Share with a friend. Like. Comment. Share with a friend. Yay! I don't know. I just be wanting to sing to y'all, y'all. <laughs> But I'm about to take this face off. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye. Love you, babies. Mwah, mwah, mwah.